I'm depressed. Even though I'm eating healthy, exercising, I have my partner who loves me and my pets, and frankly, life should be on easy mode for me, uh, I still am depressed. So I have spent some time thinking about why I might be because I feel like it's important to feel your feelings, examine them, and try and figure out if there's a reason behind it, and then maybe possibly take some time working on it. Sometimes there isn't a reason. Sometimes you are just depressed, and I know that feeling as well. But in this case, I have a reason why I'm depressed, and there is a lot of compounding factors of why, but I have decided that the main reason is that I've been spending too much time on social media. I try and fill my social media threads with positivity and with, you know, not too much drama, <laughs> but it still sneaks in there. Like I wasn't even subscribed to YouTube drama on Reddit, but it still snuck in because I'm subscribed to YouTubers. And I'm not actively looking up every news article there is about a certain subject, but you know, it's still a news feed. You still wanna stay informed about the world around you. And some things have been sneaking in there that have been relatively upsetting. The news will always be upsetting. I think the main point is, is that social media is, is killing my soul a little bit lately. <laughs> It's not surprising because it's very focused on what's happening in the human world and you don't become an apex predator without being a bit of an asshole species. That's not to say there aren't wonderful humans, but social media can exacerbate the idea that there's bad things, will always be bad things, never have been good things, and it makes you kind of lose focus of the world around you, for me at least. So today I'm going to go touch some grass. I think it's going to help out immensely. It's really weird how social media can make you feel like a speck in the world that doesn't matter and it feels horrible. But when you go out in nature, you're kind of quiet and you're looking at the world around you, the fact that you're a speck on the earth is comforting. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to spend some time outside together. I'm going to try and show you beautiful things about the world around you and hopefully I'll get back into a positive mindset with some perspective. I hope you enjoy. Mm. You know they say we're just animals. Yeah, what animal are you? The one that stays or the one who runs away like a prey? You cannot hide it. I'm watching you go back and forth like a creature. Some road closed ahead signs. I am hoping this does not mess with the bus schedule. <laughs> they literally put in a whole new road and I didn't notice. Like a block away from my house. <laughs> it's a very sticky road though. Alright, so normally, damn, I should have brought my sunglasses or a hat. Oh well. Um, so normally I have my headphones in and I like listening to a podcast or something, but today I'm really trying to focus on the world around me just to see how big and wonderful it is and appreciate my surroundings. So I do have my earbuds, but I have decided to turn it off and try and find the serenity 
in life. <laughs> and honestly, it feels kind of good. It feels not to have noise and just nature's noise or the world's noise, even if it is traffic. So Google Maps wants me to go all around and then come back. I know this trail. I can walk right down here and get to it. I do wonder where this goes.
All right, now to find the path back up. This one. So even though I have recorded a lot of stuff, I've been out here for about a couple hours and I've had five conversations with people who have dogs. So all you have to do is compliment their dogs and you get an in real life conversation with people and that's always more pleasant than online. So my spirits are pretty lifted. I have half of the, the trail to walk and then another half an hour to get home. I wouldn't say I'm completely not depressed. Factors still are factoring, but my, my, my spirits are lifted. <laughs> so, yeah, it was a good thing. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.